Today, I'll solve one numerical problem on head loss of pipe. Here is the problem. A pipeline carrying oil of specific gravity 0.8 changes in diameter from 300 mm at position A to 500 mm in diameter at position B, which is 5 meter at a higher level. If the pressure at A and B are 200 kilopascal and 150 kilopascal respectively and discharge is 150 liter per second, determine the head loss and the flow direction. Now here the picture is given which state the problem description. So at that point A, the diameter is given that is 300 mm point b diameter is given 500 mm diameter and from a to b height difference is 5 meter and the pressure also given point a and b so that is 200 kilopascal and 150 2 kilopascal and discharge is given so that is 150 liter per second now how do we solve this problem so first in the solution that given data are here Specific gravity of oil is given 0.8, diameter A 300 mm, diameter B 500 mm, height difference between A and B 5 meters, 5 meter, pressure at A 200 kilopascal, pressure at B 152 kilopascal, discharge 150 liter per second. Now solution tips. First calculate velocity at A and B using the discharge and the dis diameter of the pipe. Then determine the total head at point A and point B and finally find the loss of head and direction of flow. So first we have to calculate velocity at point A and B as discharge is given and diameter is also given. Now here first step 1 calculate the velocity at point A and B using discharge and diameter. So given discharge is given 150 liter per second. So first we have to convert liter per second to meter cube per second. So that we can convert. Uh, then diameter A is given that is 300 meter again that will also we have to convert um, so uh, 300 mm to meter so that is 0.3 meter and diameter at B that is given 500 mm so that we have to also convert uh, mm mm to meter so that is 0.5 meter now here convert discharge to cubic so this is this is 0.3 meter this is 0.5 meter and convert discharge to cubic meter so then we have to multiply 10 to the power minus 3 means 1 liter is equal to how much so here uh, 1 meter cube per second is nothing but 1 liter per second into 10 to the power minus 3 so now here that q liters are given 150 liters per second so we can easily convert uh, we, we can easily calculate what will be the cube meter cube per second now first calculate area of area at point a of the pipe cross section area of at point a so that is pi by 4 d squared so if we plug all this value we will get the area cross section area at point a so that is 1070685 similarly we can calculate the diameter at point b pi by 4 d square so that is 0 0.019635 meter square now we know that volumetric flow rate is nothing but v into a so v will be q by a so now velocity at a point a so q meter cube per second by cross section area at point a so that is 150 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube per second by cross section area 0 0.070685 so ultimately we will get velocity is 2.12 meter per second similarly we can calculate velocity at point b that is 150 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter cube per second by cross section area at point b so that is 0.19635 meter square we will get 0 0.675 meter per second now next uh, determine the total head at a and b using Bernoulli's equation so we know uh, all this data pressure at point a pressure at point b so that is given and we have to convert uh, in Pascal or Newton per meter square so that is 200 kilopascal 200 to the power 3 Newton per meter square height difference is given 
gravitational acceleration 9.81 meter per second square density of the fluid is given as specific gravity is given specific gravity into 1000 that will be give 800 kg per meter cube now head we can calculate from Bernoulli's equation so that is h meter so p by rho g plus b square by 2g plus z now at point a that head is p a by rho g plus b a square by 2g plus z a now z a is 0 so from here so if we plug all this value so we can easily get that h is nothing but 25.709 similarly we can calculate the total head at point b so that is pv by rho g plus bv square by 2g so again we plug all this value so if we plug here and here zb is 5 meter because uh, the height difference between point a and point b is 5 meter so zb is 5 meter as we took z a is equal to 0 now after plugging all this value so uh, we will get that hb is 24.389 meter now then we have to calculate what will be the loss of head or in terms of loss of energy okay so that is del ha H minus hb so substituting uh, the value that is 25.709 minus 24.389 meter so del h will be 1.32 meter so loss of head between point a and point b approximately 1.32 meter now direction of the flow so we can conclude from pressure or spacer so since the pressure at point a is higher than uh, point b the flow is a to b and we can also conclude from head as head is positive so therefore always that flow will be from higher end to lower end so therefore the loss of it as therefore the loss of it is approximately 0.134 okay so this is not 134 132 meter and the flow direction is from a to b so that's it for this problem okay thank you if you have any question you can contact with this email or you can post your comments in comment section that's it thank you